well, <coughs> I'm still getting well, but I wanted to show you. I was sitting here actually <laughs> peeling my carrots, and I said, oh, I'm going to eat that apple too. Doesn't that look delicious? That's an organic um, golden yellow. Love these apples. It has like a little pink right there. Anyway, I was actually peeling these carrots, and I said, oh, my God, let me show this because I never think to show you what I'm doing before I um, get it all done. So anyway, I'm going to make a delicious salad, you can see, with these um, mini peppers, and then I have some oops, I can get them out. organic, delicious radishes. Don't those look beautiful? And then I'm going to put some feta cheese in there and some black olives, and I just have to cut all this up, and I'm going to put this avocado. I actually am just scavenging what's left in my refrigerator, <laughs> and um, all of this beautiful color. I think it's going to look fabulous. Look at these peppers. These things are amazing. But I love all this color. I think this will be gorgeous salad. And then over here, I'm making, um, this is like good old southern kind of comfort food. I'm making a roast. And I've got, it's just um, in water right now. And I put a fresh cut onion, and you can see lots of pepper, salt, a little garlic. You can see that garlic in there. And um, also in there, oh yeah, I can show you, I'm cooking these little baby potatoes that I bought. Look how cute those are. But um, they're going to taste delicious because they're cooking in this beef broth. Anyway, oops, they want an onion. <laughs> I thought, I'm so happy I thought to show you this now. And I'm going to make some brownies. So um, that's going to be my meal which is gonna be awesome. Roast potatoes. I'm gonna put these carrots in there, let them cook in that broth as well. And, um, and then um, a delicious salad and I'm gonna make some brownies. So um, got my Starbucks drink right here for some caffeine because I was up all night. Anyway, that's a long story. And then I finally got some coffee. You know how, oops, sorry, <laughs> y'all are like, I've been saying I was gonna get some coffee. So I'll show you that in a minute. But I'm so happy because I definitely need this. See this? Dark. I need that mega caffeine. And I love that it was pink and had the Eiffel Tower. <laughs> My favorite. Okay. Much love. I think we're working. Finally. Uh, I've tried to video this like four times and the phone keeps ringing. So I'm hoping right now I can get in like a two second hey for today. I'm much better. Um, when I got home last night, I felt kind of sick again. I guess I kind of overdid it, you know, since I'd been running a pretty high fever and in bed for a few days. <laughs> but that's the way I roll, just right out there. Anyway, um, I wanted to show you this coffee a little bit better because this is pink and it's supposed to be extra dark with a lot of caffeine. And that's what I need these days. How about y'all? Anyway, I'm so happy I finally remembered to get coffee because I just can't. I had these little coffee things that I never used that were either decaf or like where that's five dots. These had one dot, so that kind of means like no caffeine. Not a good idea. Um, and I did a little bit something different today. This is the Starbucks hibiscus. I usually get a cool lime refresher and then I put the berries in the limes, but today I got the hibiscus refresher and I put the limes and the berries and it's delicious. And this has a lot of caffeine because this is made with a green coffee bean and that's supposed to be really good for your face too. So I need to do all that that I can. <laughs> um, and I was going to show you, I'm going to make these brownies. I'm super excited because it's a package. So that's so easy. Um, you can see this cup by cup. This is from Williams and Sonoma, but this is from this bakery in um, Paris. Um, I can't remember. It starts with a B. I think it's called Boucheron Bakery. Anyway, um, I'll tell you how they, I'll show you how they turn out, but these are yummy, I bet. And um, I was going to show you outside because today was another amazing, like no one even here, everyone's like, oh my God, we're having the most fabulous weather ever. I think it's going. That would be phone call number four that just came in. I don't know what's going on. Anyway, um, the weather is amazing. And also tonight, I don't know if y'all get this there, but the um, National Football Championship for um, 
football, but not soccer, like real football, American football, not real football, not to be offensive. Anyway, it's tonight and it's in Pasadena. I wish I could go because it's my alma mater from college, Auburn University. So War Eagle, fight on all you guys that are here from uh, Auburn, Alabama. How funny is that? <laughs> so I'll let you know who wins. It's gonna be Auburn, I think, for sure. They're playing Florida State, so we should definitely crunch them. Anyway, <laughs> that's exciting. Um, I'm gonna show you how my flowers, because of this warm, warm weather, it's crazy. Oh, here's Coco, let's see. Oh, I can't get her. Um, it's crazy how it's like summertime. And I think that's some of the allergies that everybody's having, but I actually had a fever, and a lot of my kids have had it, so it was definitely something. And I heard some of y'all have it, so sending you lots of positive, positive energy and um, good vibes to get well. Oh, and I'm going to try to post the videos. Clayton's going to send them to my computer tonight from Revolution because I um, posted the words on my blog for Courage to Grow and Good Vibes. Uh, look those up on YouTube. It's called Revolution and like Rebel and then Revolution and um, Courage to Grow is an amazing song. All their songs are super inspiring, very positive. It's reggae, which I love, but um, it was an amazing concert. So um, Clayton actually got, there were three other bands there, and he got uh, two of the guys from two of the bands, saxophone player, I think, and the trumpet player tweeted him back. So that's pretty exciting. Anyway, um, I'll show you the outside, and then I'll show you my dinner later tonight. So so happy to see you guys even though i don't see you i feel like i see you so much love so look at how these flowers i think these are called i'm not sure what they're called could could be snapdragons but i'm not really sure but anyway look how they're just blooming all this gorgeous color and um then up here i don't know why the pool's off oh christine was laying out so you can see how warm it was but we kind of have to, the sun goes down quickie, quickie, quicker, so she goes over here. But anyway, um, this is what I can't believe. I mean, they're just like busting out with all this color, and it's January. I mean, you forget what month it is. It's so amazingly beautiful. Well, I hope you can see it's so bright. I don't know. I can't tell if this is actually showing you or if it's just too bright. And I love to look up at palm trees. Do y'all love that? Just feel that swaying, and I just try to let all the stress blow off. And no, nothing is going to stop you. Good is going to come, and you will rise to the top and be the best. Claim it. That's what I say. Don't let anybody dim your sparkle. Forget that crap. Hell to the no, as we like to say in the South. Hell to the no. All right, well, much love, you guys, and dinner is coming up. Oh, almost dropped my camera, my phone. And, oh, I was going to tell you, somebody, I can't remember if it's Bodie or Yay or somebody, love this box. Oh, my God, my camera's breaking. This is a wine box. Go to any wine store, and a lot of times wine comes in these um, wooden boxes, and I actually have one in my house as well. I'll show you real quickly. Um, oh, there's Chloe. Chloe, say hey. Somebody want to know where the dogs were. They're right by me. They're right by me. Yes, they are. Anyway, um, here's another box. See, I have it in my house. And I just stuff it full of flowers. Yep. My little creative idea. Okay, you guys. Much, much love. And this orchid that is from Ikea, which is from Sweden. Oh, my God. I have to do another video, but I have to tell you really quickly. Yesterday, when we were walking around at the... Um, Estancia, Estancia La Jolla, and it looks like La Jolla, L-A-J-O-L-L-A. -L -L -A. Are you kidding me? I said La Jolla, and my kids were like, Mom, it's La Jolla. Who would know that? But anyway, the lady, I swear, I wish I had this on video. We're walking around. She's showing us, and she's like, wow, this fam, y'all all look so much alike and everything. You must be Swedish. Y'all look Swedish. Swear to God. And we all bust out laughing and we're like, yeah, we get that all the time. I'm telling you, I'm going to have it done. I'm going to have the test done. It's going to be amazing. Okay. Much love you guys.